Hi, I'm Merrick Tomato, and welcome back to Let's Play 007 The World Is Not Enough. I've been through a preview of hell today. I was stuck on the metro for about 15 minutes with. Well, I'll, I'll tell you later in the, uh, in the level when we don't have anything else to talk about. Avoid alerting Gabor, avoid alerting Death. Ha 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 ha! It's obviously your next target. That it's obvious that you were right. Electra's Renard's next target. We need to discover the traitor inside King Industries. Electra's head of security, a man named Davidov, we suspect has been having secret meetings with an unknown person who we think may be Renard. We need proof, however, and that is where you go. Take a look in Davidov's security office and search for evidence of a conspiracy with Renard. Robinson, Jesus, Chief of Staff. Electra's villa has a high level of security. Take a quiet look around and determine Davidov's activities. Our number one suspect is Davidov. He received training from the KGB, but left when they got informed. He ended up working for the king around four years ago. For king around four years ago. Only to ensure he doesn't catch on. He doesn't catch on to you. Another person to avoid is Gabor. He's Electra's bodyguard and fiercely loyal to Elector. He won't take kindly to anyone sneaking around his mistress's property. Electra still doesn't fully trust you, and if she discovers that you're spying on her employees, she'll be furious. Don't harm any of Electra's other workers. All but Davidov are certainly innocent. Apart from the patrolling guards, you need to watch out for the cameras. They've got motions. Oh, fuck! This is gonna suck! Motion sensors at the limited range. Each set of cameras is linked to a nearby security hub, so your best course of action is probably to find those security centers and disabling their systems. Be sure to get out of your room without causing suspicion. Right, I pay attention to the The P2K is silenced, but there shouldn't be any shooting unless things go horribly wrong. The restaurant's dark dungeon will suffice for most situations. The other crew will be far more useful for this mission. Our new X ray glasses, a digital camera that will operate in the darkness, phone tabs, and, safe, and a safe decryptor to help you gather evidence. Oh, fuck this entire mission already! I know this is gonna hurt. Deeply. Good evening. I don't find stuff fun. Electra's Villa has a high level of security. I know this. Take a quiet look around and see what Davidov is up to. R is here to tell you about the security system. Apart from the patrolling guards, you'll need to watch out for the security cameras. They've got motion sensors with a limited range. Each set of cameras is linked to a nearby security office, so your best course of action is probably finding those security centers and disabling their systems. Be sure to get out of your room without causing suspicion. Take care to stay in the room, Mr. Bond. I would hate for a guard to shoot you by mistake. Sure. Oh, fuck my life. I hate stealth. It isn't fun, it isn't well designed ever, this is just painful, and it's gonna hurt a lot. And I've dealt with a lot of pain today, seeing as how I got stuck on a metro for 15 minutes, I was sitting there, two fucking idiots, come on. Remember 007, you need to utilize... ...with accordions, and start playing Esposito. For 15 fucking minutes, and then expect money for it. I don't think they see me. Ugh. 
Okay, we're gonna need to laser that. Assuming we need to crouch. That's done. Now we can start murdering people. I hope. Casualties, right, because it's gonna be one of those those sucky shit missions. Where I can't kill people. Glasses. That's a thingy, Majigger. Use a thingamajig there, don't I? Uh, data scrambler? Probably the data scrambler. No, you die temporarily. At least. I'm stuck! Why am I stuck on something? Ugh. Take guns. Okay, auto-aim? Fucking great. I like it. Swimming pool, if not that drunk. Probably 
feel I should drink to get the most out of this game. Even though it'd be almost some freaking playable. More locked. Them decorative rooms. Uh, grapple points, fair enough. Stoink. Okay, this isn't so bad, really. Uh, I was getting worked up for nothing. It's not the whole you're seeing immediate mission fail, so that's nice. Oh, that was Gabor? Do we get a fun cutscene? Or do we just fail the mission completely? So, was that guy Gabor? Okay, so don't shoot Gabor. Good to know. This doesn't have a Bond intro. Huh. I just realized this doesn't have one of them cool, um... With the, with the little thing and the... Gun side and shooting. And the banana, da 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 many poisons that you'll never fucking sit up again. Here. And there. There is it. Unfortunately, this is guaranteed they'll know we've been here. Oh, no, no, we, we want our thingy back. Not the, the machine gun, what's wrong? Okay, gadgets. Data scrambler. Actually, kind of enjoying this mission. Come on, it was a fucking millimeter off. Okay, so so far we've done what objectives? Nothing. Sweet. Find telephones and plant. Oh my! Right, telephones. I forgot about the telephone. Backtrack in time because I did the game wrong. Hey, hey. I want it to be going like the fucking bombs and uh, the other game there. And that other mission. I forget what it was called. Uh, up oh, this phone. One. No. 
now we can continue, because there's probably the other one's probably further and down in the level. Did you almost say go go boko now? Never knew this wrist fucking watch darts would be so fucking useful. And I forgot to put the pop filter on the mic again. Brilliant. Brilliant work there, Merrick. Credit to the Let's Player profession. Fortunately, it is a good distance away from me, and I'm not speaking directly into it. Uh, it's omnidirectional, it's getting the, uh, the side of my mouth. That's uh, better, I guess. Especially when I do a weird things with my mouth. Why am I talking about this? I don't know. It's been a long day and I had to listen to Esposito, one of the worst songs of all time, played on an accordion. That's clever. That's on the. Ooh, wow. We forgot the, uh, the phone. Oh, no, there's the other phone. Um, just quick save here. First. Probably GTFO right now before a uh, guy in the suit shows up, or was he us? I can never tell. Hi.
Take a picture of him? Double check that objective. The world is not enough. Photograph documents. Well, this is bad. We fucked up in a major way. The other documents were in there. Mission is we, we've broken the mission. We gotta be fast, fast there. <laughs> Let's try this again. I knew this mission would be a fucking problem. Stealth is always a problem for me. Now I know what I'm doing, at least. Good evening, Double S7. Nope. Don't need your talking. <sighs> we can go through this with relative speed. Weapons. Start out. Five. Remember, 007, you need to utilize all of your stealth training to avoid detection while in the villa. Avoid confrontation at all costs. No, don't call Gabor! Hmm. Sorry about that, but you were gonna call Gabor. We don't want you to call Gabor. Talkies. Hmm. Frankly, it's a pretty substantial oversight on their part. Oh, that's Gabor. Hmm. Go, go, 
Oh, no, you cold! Oh, balls, that's bad. Not great. That's how I'm doing, I'm doing not great. Wish I had like a hot, I could hot key gadgets. That'd be cool. That's fucking Gabor. Yeah. How is Gabor alerted by me knocking him out? How does that lead back to me at all? Do they know I have a, st a dark gun in my watch? They shouldn't. How does Gabor keep seeing me? Why can't I knock out Gabor? That's bullshit. It's bullshit. It's bullshit, Hulk Hogan. What? No. Quick, call Gabor. Ah! In the last few seconds of consciousness he had, he called Gabor. That's what I didn't want him to do. Ooh, fuck, it's Gabor. Sneezing. I can relate. texting me and that pisses me off. If you hadn't guessed, I don't like communicating with people. It's not my, it's something I resent having to do in life. Okay. Set this up so I can't win. I like it. I love, I just fucking love it. This game is so fucking stupid. Oh, this is so arbitrary, though. This is so arbitrary. So I can't be anywhere near Gabor, but Gabor's right where I need to be. Fuck me. Okay, moving on. That was much harder the second time around. Oh. There's a goober. Stoink. You're down. I'm trying not to break any of their windows this time. I'll just take an angry at us. You're not calling Gabor. Oh, yes, I can! Oh, that's a phone tab, never mind. Why didn't they give this to Rare? Rare could have made something a little less clunky. Because they would already, they at this point they had already done uh, 007 and Perfect Dark, so they could have made a really great game, but they didn't want to, I guess.
hang of this after fail fucking up majorly. It's not gonna be like Stranglehold, it's not gonna give me a fucking nervous breakdown. Or like Da Vinci Code, it's not gonna it's not gonna break me. It's a pretty It's a pretty okay first person shooter. It's fine. We're fine. It's fine. We're good. It's fine. This won't fucking break me. Never again. Dirt. Like, you'd think that the grapple, at least, could go in gadgets because it's not a fucking weapon. You're down. You're back. Ah, oh, we forgot the safe last time, too, so I guess for the best. Gadgets. Safe cracker. So that's where, okay, so it wasn't in the other room. We were way too So we didn't have to play through the entire level again. Okay. We didn't have to suffer through the endless gab... The, the eternal Gabor. Zsa Zsa Gabor. Witness for the prosecution. No, that was Marlena Dietrich. What am I talking about? Zsa Zsa Gabor? There was a, a film noir movie that had... Zsa Zsa Gabor in it. But briefly, very briefly. Camera. There he comes. This makes me mad! There we fucking go. And into the car trunk, and we're good. Whew! Wow, our shadow's weird. Well, his shadow's weird too. Why do the shadows start mid fight? That's just an emulation error. Yay! We win! Oh! That was a perfect mission! Midnight Departure. Eliminate Davidoff, pick up Davidoff's phone, get control of the land plane, board the plane, avoid civilian casualties. So we can kill people! Yay! Your job is to protect Electra King from Renaud, not to leave her in the middle of the night. I hope you have good reason for your recent activities, Dr. M's just please 007, but a man should look at all those things he asked about. The dead body in the back of Davidoff's town is Mikhail Arkov, a nuclear physicist with the Russian Atomic Energy Department. It looks as if Davidoff is going to pose as Arkov for some reason. You should keep that reason alive by posing as Arkov to you. Ah, no, no! Fuck! Uh, I hate this game! Mmm! I can't do anything as simple as backing out of being com I, well, What if someone, like, hit the button by mistake? You know, like I fucking did. I guess hit the two fucking loading screens, abort the mission, and go through all that again. Because this game was designed by a monkey. <sighs> hey, 
And why is A no? What sense does that make? For some... I like by posing as Arkov too if you get the chance. Davidov used his office phone to call an old military airstrip that was supposed to have been shut down years ago. It looks as if Davidov is going to be catching a plane tonight. He's also expecting a call later on and we've got a cellular number listed for him. If you can acquire Davidov's cell phone it will come in useful. We took a look at the other items you sent us. Davidov's been receiving large cash payments from a bank we know is used by the Russian Mafia to launder the money. I'd say that Renard has been paying him off. Davidov is an innocent bond, and almost certainly a traitor. Well, Bond, if you're going to insist on running around the forest after dark, I've got a couple of items that should give you an edge over anyone else who's out there. These night vision goggles are allowed to see clearly, even in the darkest environment. The power cell will automatically recharge when you're not using them. Oh, and we thought you might want something with a little more range than your PP than your P2K. Oh fuck, it's a sniper rifle mission. I hate those. I just hate everything, is what I'm getting at. Sniper rifles suck on the N64, man. Former Soviet military base. So I can't even pronounce that. But I'm gonna try to pronounce that word. Do this mission, call the video. We got a, uh, this sniper rifle. Stunner. We can kill. Good. Delta Mag. That's a crossbow? What? Fuck it, A. I got a crossbow, bitch. Daryl Dixon in the house. That's not at all how Daryl sounds. I'm very sorry about that. It's actually kind of chronically racist. What gadget do I have to use on that? Nitrogen goggles. That won't help. I think I found a glitch! Here. Maybe Davidoff's hiding out there. Quickly, sound the alarm. What alarm? Oh, so you turn. Oh! Oh, those are alarms! Okay. It's good to know. Oh. 
Oh, baby, I know I'm playing a horrible James Bond. I know I shouldn't play the bad James Bond games, but I have to. The viewers demand it. Even though I don't really have any. I'm playing for viewers who don't exist, baby. Yeah, I know I love you too. What's that? You, you want me to keep playing the game because you hate me, Kokut? Well, fuck you too. Where the hell is Davidov? Davidov, where you where you hide? I have bullet for your head. Come here. Davidov! Hey boy! Who's a good Davidov? Come here, Davidov! Davidov! Are you by the river? Where are you? Nothing. Great. Yeah, let's just wander through the woods at night. This is a great plan. Are there any even any civilians here? Oh, I get it. Maybe on um, Double O Agent, it's um, all those dudes with crossbows are actually civilians. That would make sense, actually. Like, they're just hunters. There's an so I can't really buy anything that sees us and immediately tries to kill us as being a civilian. Uh, there's a cheat that gives you infinite night vision. Night vision doesn't seem all that useful. Nothing here is very dark, so I don't have a point to it. Just like the x-ray specs in the last level weren't really useful. Because the big situations where uh, we got snuck up on were all outside. This game's pretty short, so I'm already giving some thought to what to do after it. I'm gonna see if I can I'm gonna try to be able to record Jedi Knight. Uh, the sequel to Dark Forces 2. I'm gonna give that a fucking try, because I really want to play that game. I mean, I can play the game anytime I want, but I really want to record that game. If not, um... I might do Godfather 2... Got that installed and ready to go, actually. Could do... Could do another, not based on any specific movie, more on a... On a, a mythos thing, and do Robin Hood, Defender of the Crown, maybe Rune, one of those. You can get extra points for this game by shooting people in the deck. Where am I going? This map is confusing. Is there what? Sorry, Daryl. Quickly. 
Guns are guns for a reason. Because they're great. I think we're on the right track. Kill Davidov. Take his phone. But none of this matters unless I can fucking find Davidov. The mysterious, unfindable Russian man. You in here? Nope. <sighs> Davidov, where are you? Dude, fucking really, come out. Come on, not gonna hurt you. It's gonna blow your fucking brains. It's gonna blow them right the fuck in. Davidov. Oh, Davidov. Come on, I just want to watch Skeleton Warriors with you. What's your problem, dude? Let's go. Gonna watch Skeleton Warriors. It's a great show, man. Come on, let's watch Skeleton Warriors. Because Lightstar, he has the power. Talon's a fighter in the sky. Grimskull knows the way of the shadows. And Guardian shouts the battle cry for the Legion of Light. Ah, Christ, I'm back at the beginning of the level. Fuck. Yeah, I'm gonna call it for here. I'm lost as hell. Ciao, guys. Hi, thanks for watching. This has been played and recorded by me, Merrick D'Amato. The art was by Rafael Agrona. You can find a link to their commission page in the description below. And if you, li if you like this video and want to see more like it, like, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for watching, and see you all next time. Ciao!